Hello everyone, this is Michelle from Echo Craft Co, and welcome back to another Plan With Me video. So for this week, I didn't use any weekly kits. I mainly used some Sailor Missing the washi samples from my shop. For the pens, I used this Muji 0.5 gel pen, which is my all-time favorite, and also this zebra brush pen. I put down the bottom washi first, as always. I chose this pink one with all different Sailor Moon elements on it, which I think is super cute. I really like the washi tapes with different drawings or pictures on them because I can easily cut the patterns I like and then use it as a full box. Here I'm using this Sailor Chibi Moon part to decorate the top box of the sidebar. When I was planning for this week, I used each day or each column to represent one or two Sailor Moon characters. So for the sidebar, the theme is Sailor Chibi Moon. After putting down a blue washi from my shop, I also added this habit tracker from Joy of Planning to track my healthy eating for this week. Then I put down a pink washi strip and layered on top a Remember Script sticker from my shop to create a header. On Monday, I put down a strip of washi and layered on top a sunny coffee sticker from my shop to mark in Monday coffee. Then I added this galaxy banner sticker as a decoration because I think the banner really matched the Sela Moon theme. After that, I used this Sela Jupiter washi as a full box. Underneath the full box, I added this bow half box along with the process order sticker from my shop to mark I need to work on some orders later that day. I also added this Sela Jupiter deco sticker from Draw Your Planning as a decoration for Monday's Sela Jupiter theme. On Tuesday, I need to film a plan with me video in the morning, so I use the film sticker from the Coffee Monsters Cow. Then I spent some time designing a new weekly kit, and I used the pink bow half box from my shop to mark that. I have been seeing a lot of people doing this washi full boxes and they basically put a bunch of washi across the full box and then cut along the edges of the full box and the end result looks really amazing so I really want to try it myself but actually being like a little bit freak out in the middle because I think my full box looks really messy but after I cutting out the edges the final result looks way better and I'm so glad I tried it.
On Wednesday, I first put on this Asela Macri washi as a full box. I actually don't like planning for Wednesday because it's really near the coil and I have so much trouble writing there. So I always try my best to use box stickers like quarter box or half box so I can write on the sticker first and then stick them on my planner or using a lot of script stickers to avoid writing on the planner directly. On Thursday, I cut a strip of washi into a page flag shape to mark my morning tea. The tea bag sticker is from me and my big idea sticker book. I currently really start to like clear sticker paper, especially after I got a Hobonichi A6 planner. I really like their thin paper, which keep the planner relatively small and really easy to carry around. But I noticed that if I use a lot of stickers, it will make it really hard to write on the next page because of the stickers kind of create different levels and the surface is not as smooth. I don't know whether this, this makes sense, but because of the clear paper is thinner, it kind of solve this problem. So I will start to offer clear matte paper options for majority of the stickers in my shop. to Friday, I first put on this Scylla mask washi and then marked in my cheating day with a cat emoji sticker from Joy of Planning. Then I wrote my shop's flash sale and decorated that area with a Scylla Mars sticker from Joy of Planning as well. I used the blue bow half box from my shop to mark in my workout. Then I added a vacuum sticker from Stick With Me Shop and paired that with a sunny sticker from my shop to remind myself to tidy up at Friday night. Moving on to the weekend, I first started by putting down two strips of washi to create a weekend banner. And I also added a weekend bunny sticker from Joy of Planning. On Saturday, I did my design and coffee Saturday morning at my local coffee shop. And the coffee sticker is from Stick With Me Shop. Then I use a bunch of washi to create a washi banner to block a large chunk of time because I don't have so many things to do on Saturday. We tried our best to take at least one day off per week. I did need to do some photo editing on Saturday morning and I used a camera sticker from Paper and Milk.
on Sunday, I first put down a set of Venus washi at the bottom. Sunday is usually my shop's new releases day, so I use a Peekaboo Sushi sticker to mark that. Then I spend the rest of the day plan for the next week and process a lot of orders. The Selavina sticker is from Joya Planning and the hand letter sticker is from my shop. Here I cut some pictures from a washi sample and use them as deco stickers to add on top of the spread. But to be honest, I'm a little bit regret doing this because the whole spread is already have a lot of different elements and pictures. I feel adding these decals just make the whole spread really busy. But that what I learned, sometimes less is more. That's pretty much it for this week. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next one.